pronghorn wasp. It was funny, I actually rescued it of a big ass spider web that was caught. It's doing fine now. Let's see if she'll move. I'll put my finger beside it to show the size of her. She's pretty relaxed though, she's not moving too much. There she goes. There you go. Now you put your lighter beside you. lighter? Yeah. Oh, I don't have my lighter on me. So, I forget what they call it a pigeon longhorn wasp. Is it long horn or yeah. horn, horn tail? tail. Horn, horn tail. tail. That's it. Horn tail. Here. I'll zoom out. Yeah, she's more than half the length of the lighter. Oh, yeah, just over half. It's really weird. It's like I don't even get how she'd be able to sting somebody with that. Because the other sting, or her whatever's in the way there, where she legs her eggs from. I got my tripod. Zoom it right in. You ever see all the detail of it? I like the <clears> red <throat> marking on the top of her head. Yeah, see the weird colors there. Yes. Oof. Oh, dog. I dog. You can watch it. You can tell she's looking right at the camera. Don't worry, I'm not gonna fuck with you. There we go. And that the focus right on her face is the hard part. I see she's got tiny, tiny mandibles like they're. Not like a normal wasp, but they have huge honking ones. Whatever neat cheese. Alright. We'll put her back up in the tree or something, she'd do better.